Good evening. A Hong Kong International Terminals has applied for an injunction after days of protests by cargo workers at container terminal number six in Kwai Chung. The dock workers have been there since last Thursday over a pay dispute. Levelina Lung reports. Day five of strike action by dock workers at the number six Kwai Chung container terminal, pressing for higher wages. Some of them travel from Kwai Chung to Wan Chai in Central this afternoon, demanding dialogue with Hong Kong International Terminals, or HIT, which operates the container terminal. They accuse Hutchison Wampoa, the parent company of HIT, of suppressing their right to industrial action by applying for an injunction. They want Hutchison Wampoa to improve the way it contracts out the work at the container terminal in order to provide reasonable pay and benefits. The demonstration then moved on to the government house, where the workers asked the government to introduce laws to protect collective bargaining rights. Originally, more of the protesting dot workers had planned to come here to voice their discontent. However, because there were rumors that HIT was going to force the protesters out of the Kwai Chung container terminal, so most of the workers decided to stay behind in Kwai Chung to prevent this from happening. The Confederation of Trade Unions is helping the workers fight their case. Uh, we believe that uh, the, uh, the company, uh, if they are really responsible, uh, they should try to resolve the dispute through uh, uh, negotiation with the union and not using a uh, high-handed measure like uh, applying for an injunction order and getting the police into the case. The injunction sought by HIT includes prohibiting anyone from entering or staying at its facilities in Kwai Chung or disrupting normal operations there. HIT's lawyer said in court today that the situation is urgent and is seriously affecting the cargo terminal's operations. The number of protesters, he added, is growing. But the Union of Hong Kong Dockers said this will not affect their action. Our uh, industrial action will, will, be, will, going on, will be going on. So uh, no, no matter any injunction or success, successful or not, we're still going on. Yeah, the, the action will not stop. Li Chai-yang also argued that the protest is a peaceful gathering. More and more people are joining, he explained, because they're protesting against HIT's decision to apply for an injunction. But he denied the crowd is disrupting the normal functions of the terminal. This morning, members of staff from HIT handed out notices to the 200 or so protesters, asking them to leave. They were warned through a loud hailer that they should clear the area by noon. A spokesman insisted they are organized and will continue to demand dialogue with HIT. But he accused the company of lacking sincerity in resolving the dispute. Evelyn Line, TVB News.